Okay, I'm gonna show you how we're going to color in our thermometer over here. You're going to need three colors, blue, red, and yellow. Blue will stand for cold, yellow will stand for warm, and red will stand for hot. I'm gonna start with blue. We're gonna start from the bottom. So in Celsius, cold starts at about 15 degrees, or I'm sorry, five degrees. So I count up, here's the zero, one, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna put a line right there, and then I'm gonna color in the whole bottom part blue. Next, I'm going to add yellow for warm. Warm goes from about five degrees all the way up to about 30 degrees. There's the 30, there's the five would be all the way up to 30. So I'm gonna put a line here at 30 and then I'm gonna color this in yellow. Finally, everything above 30 degrees is hot. So I'm gonna color the top part red. All right. Now when it's time to measure temperature and record it, this is how you're going to do it. Remember our green water from a minute ago? So I'm gonna take the temperature of the green water. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna read the temperature, which you can see it's the line goes up to 20 degrees on the Celsius side. So I record 20 degrees. Now let's pretend that this red water was really green water, just for my purposes, but you'll actually be measuring red water. And we know that it's 20 degrees Celsius. So I look over here in the zone. This is below zero, so we're not using those ones, but above zero, 20 is in the warm zone. So then I would circle warm right here. Then I would take my thermometer out of the water and I would go test the other colors of water. Remember when you do the classroom air that um, you just hold it up in the air and count to five and let the temperature adjust. And then we're gonna have to change Pepe's water to something else. I'll bring you guys a surprise. Okay, bye-bye.